right there when I was doing that, I just felt like the, the guy from Can I Have Your Number? Can I have your number? Can I have your number? Can I have the digits that if entered telephonically would be to your beautiful boot number? <laughs> so, uh, anyways, I'm going to cut that part out because that was really dumb. What's up, guys? It's 3.43 in the morning, and I am getting ready to, I just woke up a few minutes ago. I'm going to take a scoop of this cinnamon ice cream sport. I always have a protein shake when I wake up. Body's hungry. I'll have a... Uh, Banana for some carbs since I'm getting ready to go to the gym. And then I'll put together my pre workout, which is some of this Core Fury. A couple scoops of that stacked on with some Versa 1. And my Nothing Works Unless You Do Shaker Cup. And to start off the day, that will be. Let's see if I can get this on here. That will be 2 grams of fat, 27 carbs, and 24 grams of protein. Let's keep going. Alright, it's uh, 4.25, we are here at any time, running a little bit late, but running a little late, but we're going to rock it out. Just got done at the gym, getting ready to go to work, running a little bit late. I'm going to mix a scoop of creatine here post-workout into my BCAAs. I'm going to add in some grape juice, that way the insulin, that way uh, the sugars help the uh, insulin receive the creatine a lot better than doing anything with acidic acids or water. And then post-workout I'm going to have this Jack Lee's beef jerky. 
Then we'll eat breakfast here around 7.30. Breakfast time. Nutrition by design. 34 grams of protein. 24 carb. 4 grams of fat. That's uh, low sodium. A cup of noodle on crack. And it'll put me up at, so far, 8 grams. 8 grams of fat for the day. 117 carbs. 73 grams of protein. Alright guys, it's uh, 10.42. I'm running late on my uh, my 10 o'clock meal, but what I've got here for my little 10 o'clock snack or meal or whatever you want to call it, I've got some Okios Greek yogurt, and I'm going to put a couple of these chocolate rice cakes back. Digging that. Real quick treat for you guys. Uh, I just had to do a safety stand down to blow down a Braden head that was getting high on this location. But what was epic about it is I had to do stop work. And I want you to see how much work I had to stop <laughs> in order to get this done. Alright, it's 12.53, I'm getting a little late on my lunch, we're going to pull it out of my little heater deal I got going on down here. A buddy gave me this as a trade, the barter system, I miss that system. We're going to fork over here in the old six pack bag. Let's see what we have for lunch today. And it is steak and pork and beans, or baked beans. Yes, carbohydrates and protein. No greens in this, but I'll have a lean green shake later. So I had to take a break from work just for a minute because I have so much paperwork to do and computer typing that I was getting just getting tired from that just uh, just mentally so uh, I'm gonna put my lunch back get back to work and then on my next update which will be my 2 30 3 o'clock meal or snack, whatever you want to call it, I'll, uh, I'll probably post how much where my macronutrients are at. But I don't want you to get caught up in, well he's eating every two hours or he's eating at these specific times. The only reason I have these specific times is it just kind of reminds me to eat on the essence of I get so busy at work that I kind of have to keep an eye on the clock and say, oh you know what, I probably, because yeah, you, you could say, well yeah, just eat when you're hungry. And you know, then I could eat my banana when I'm hungry in this, and I do that. But when I get so caught up, I do get hungry. But I have something I need to get done. So when I look at the clock, I can say, "Well, I'm about to go do this. Should I just eat it right now and then go do this, or should I do this and then eat?" So far, uh, I, like I said, I don't know why you guys would even watch this, but I was hoping that you would just be able to get an idea of what I eat just so it kind of gives an example. Now it's not what I eat every every day. Obviously I switched up specific things, you know, different breakfasts. I eat sludge a lot for breakfast, so. But anyways, just a generality. So, thanks guys. And uh, don't forget, I'll keep, I'll continue this video, keep going for the rest of the day, but don't forget at the end of this video, you know, like the video for me. You know, subscribe to the video, to the YouTube channel. That'd be awesome. Uh, just let me know that that you guys are watching it as far as you guys are enjoying it otherwise uh, we can we can try something different so appreciate it alright so we're finishing up for the day gonna have some dinner now uh, Megan made me some awesome baked like panko bread crusted chicken really lean awesome not full of sodium type of chicken so it's really good 
We also have like a tricolor rotini grain, uh, whole grain pasta with asparagus. And to finish off my day, just to let you guys know, I'm going to finish off with 43 grams of fat, 315 carbs, and 226 grams of protein, which is awesome. Uh, my fiber is going to be 29 grams of fiber, one less than I probably would have wanted, but all in all, a really good day. So I'll finish up by, before the evening by having my omega-3s, my melatonin. I haven't taken my multivitamins yet, so I'll add in my orange triad. I'll add in my fiber and some Resurrect PM and probably some advanced protocol, and we'll be good to go. But that was the day of my food and what I ate just to give you a general idea how I do my diet. Because everybody always asks people all the time how they do theirs. Do they eat every two hours or is it just chicken breast? So I just wanted to show you how I fit everything in my macros and I still only had 43 grams of fat when I shoot for a max of 60. So to have 17 grams less of fat throughout the day, pretty successful day. So I'll tell you what guys, I'm going to eat dinner. We're gonna hang out with the baby. Have a good evening. I'm just spitting, living, revealing what I do. Roll with the family. Every time I step up to venues, I gotta resume. Have deadlines to me. Ain't gotta